Good morning and welcome to this let's play on the of Bergman map uh, FS17 and I am Andy and uh, we're gonna do some I'm gonna buy a hook lift I think there you know, back attached standard a lot of men engine setups I don't know which you go for 6 20 Sweet Tetra Agra. Oh, man. Do know which to get. What about platform? Perhaps more mobile. Need a bumper. Flat small bumper. Medium bumper. I don't know. 242,000. Um, do you get a street? Six I'm thinking go with street. So the idea is to sell sell off our. Where is it? This one. Universal trailer and uh, the, the trailer behind. And I'm gonna go and get some. A hook lift technology which can be found here I think tippers I think so here's the IT runner and then we can get all these things we have one of those already and these we use for stuff um, there's also here I think somewhere this one which holds 50,000 liters which is much, much better and that's kind of it's not that's quite inexpensive so that's one thing I'm planning on getting to transport our fuel. So, but first we have to go and sell this. We get some money. So, we buy the things we need. Uh, oh, sorry. I was like, uh, I don't recognize myself here. I was planning on go doing some slurry. Actually, I'm going to sell some pigs, but first I'm going to get this set up. This can go. This way we can back it up quite easily. Should we get some beacons on? Oh, sorry. Wrong way. this but it's very underpowered I mean you struggle so much getting the biofuel to heating plant uh, with this one and I feel that yeah we should you could use that in a better way um, and with the uh, hook lift trailer we can use and truck with a hook left we can use different s sorts of um, trailers or well, containers and other stuff do not call that, I call something else probably So the link to the MAN hooklift truck is in the mod, uh, I think it's version 5 or something, 5.3 actually. I just read it on the other screen. So it's version 5.3 and we're going to try it out. Hopefully it will work pretty nicely. If I can get by it. Yep. 
over here. Hello, someone said hello. So, so. And so, 300,000, that means we can buy our truck. But which back attacher? Most powerful, semi most. 520 or 620? 620, 620. get the power. The street version, six six wheel, touch agrar, touch off road, and agrar, and off road, street eight. Yeah. So I'll think we'll go with a six. Don't know what these are. go with the street standard wheel cover uh, colors we should have uh, go with something cool green weird green color now that's too weird green we'll go orange red red uh, orange with a bumper we'll go with a medium bumper standard wheel cover and buy okay so 56 I'm gonna go and look at it. So here's our nice hook lift trailer. Let's see, X unfolds the hook lift. That's good. Beacons look nice. Different lights. That's not good. Indicators. Looks good. Ah, good mod. Looks like it pretty decent model so we're gonna buy um, first we're gonna go buy one of these to transport the fuel in so we'll have a yellow one I mean, not yellow without overload pipe yes, please. buy two of these and then we'll have to buy a hook clip where is that where is it? No, that's in the tippers. Sorry, I think that's pretty expensive. It's Twenty? No, not six fifty-five. We don't have fifty-five, so we need to borrow some money, money to get that fifty-five. That's okay. Tippers will go one. IT runner here, fifty-five. That's okay. Good color. So first we'll just get this attached. X to get it onto our truck. Unfold that using the X button. Oh, done. And let's get that onto the truck. So, maybe this is a weird color combination. I still think you're gonna go. go be able to do other stuff. Let's go to our truck. Here you go. Register left control Y. Okay. I don't know where that is. Where are we? Hof Bergman. Where is Hof Bergman? Bergman. from what well, is the name of this town by the way let's see let's go out here so Fuchshausen just see if it's the real town Fuchshausen I seems to be you know Fuchs 
house. And no, it didn't work, so it's not. Oh, I guess it's not a real place. Ah, well, anyway. Go and cruise up to. You. So, cabin looks nice. Lipton TIC there. Good to have, I guess. Actually, I was going to go and. I will do that next time. I'll uh, do the story next time. I'll just go and get the pigs now. I'm going to drive this up to our facility for biodiesel, biogas, bioheating, biodiesel, bio biodiesel heating plant anyway. Uh, so this mod is pretty good. Uh, it was uploaded to fs17.net and on June 18th so that's just a few days ago nice version 5.3 uh, as I said before oh, good brakes so, powerful uh, oh good it has inside but you can't see that the beacons are on but the turn signals you can see those that's good see if it no it doesn't say that I, I was gonna check I checked if I could sell um, if it had an indication for the what do you call it Tron what's it called There's not a lot there. Um, if I was wondering if it had some indications for the heating, no, heating plants. God, I'm not. I'm losing my words here. I was wondering if it had some indications for the cruise control. Cruise control is the word I'm looking for. Let's get that off. And then we're going to go and get some digestate out of here uh, so we need to fix this can you open yeah can you open that wonder if that works So this is, even though it looks smaller in size, I don't know why, if it is smaller in size. Oh, good, it actually worked here. Okay, so good, we can unload here. Uh, this could be a good screenshot, I think, for this episode. Let's see, go over and save it there. So 39, so that's good. Um, so this holds 50,000, so we can easily fill this up without any problems and go over there and do that uh, in the meanwhile while this is filling up we could go and sell some pigs I think not sell go and um, leave them at our s at a slaughterhouse actually I'm going to move this um, how did you do that open open cover And move you. No. Rotate previous setting. Rotate, rotate. How did I do that? I did that before, right? Let's see to the bottom. Ah, okay. That's good. And um, 
put it there. Boom, that's good. Um, you. In dark, get the lights on. So, I'm gonna take this, these nine pigs away for slaughter. I'm sorry to say, poor little virtual pigs. I'm happy to say that you don't have any feelings and you're only ones and zeros. In a massive amount of ones and zeros, probably. Wonder amount of ones and zeros it takes to make them stand there. Just make or make it takes to make me be able to move the mouse, the viewpoint. Probably a lot. Okay. So we won't make any money off these now. We'll make money when we sell the meat later. But we need to rent a truck to do that, and we need to sell more pigs if we want to do that. See, it's down here, up here, somewhere up here. Mm -hmm. That little caster food processing plant, or meat processing plant. Meat is processing plant is probably the right, the correct terminology. Yeah, I know, I know. The placement of this was sort of pretty crappy. Sometimes it removes the cover. I think that's probably setting in course play somewhere. You can also change that, but I didn't use course play now, so it shouldn't really matter, does it? Should it? Hmm. I wonder what you use these for. That's some sort of construction material. But I don't know really where to put those. We use them for. Doesn't matter. Well, it does matter. I guess it does matter. Why do you keep saying it doesn't matter? It does matter. So I'm heading back to your main farm for some. Um, so I'm gonna wait until next season to use the the cedar which goes along with this one, which is cool. I want to try that, but there's so many settings you can set on the cedar itself, and I have no. It's I guess it's pretty realistic that way. I don't I don't think it does I don't think it matters or affects the way um the seeding is done. I don't I think that's too advanced for farming simulator seventeen. Even though farming simulator seventeen is pretty cool and uh, has a lot of settings. Well it well cool. It's better than fifteen. Um I remember, I, and I said this on Let's Plays before, that uh, I remember looking, l l listening to Ian Robson's channel, and he was talking. B that was, this was before F17 came out. And he was talking. He has a question. Had a question, sort of like, uh, will you still use F15 when F17 goes comes out, or will you stop using it? And he referred to when he switched between 13 and 15 and that he, he pretty much well he, he didn't look back basically he tried it and then it was done it was, it was so much better that there was really no point in going back so nine more pigs oh dude it's uh, I did manage to nine more pigs to the slaughterhouse. Um, so and it, it's, it was the same for me. I'm basically trying this. Uh, well, I was afraid that if I had so much stuff for FS15. I was like, hey, I, I don't want, I don't waste this. I want to use this. 
Um, I really did enjoy FS15. I got that really late. Used FS13 a bit and then didn't use Farming Simulator for many years. A year, maybe a year. And then I got 15, uh, half a year before 17 came out. Which was probably stupid, I should have waited. But uh, I enjoyed 15. And um, I got a lot of stuff, lots of maps, um, which I played on uh, a lot. Just for fun. I didn't do any recordings or anything like that. I just played it because it was fun. And then I. Uh, uh, the, my main concern was that if I get 17, I won't be able. Well, firstly, I won't be able to use all the mods and the maps I have installed but uh, that was uh, that was probably secondary to the fact that I thought that FS17 would be crap on my computer. I don't have the best computer, it's quite a few years old and I figured that it won't be able to handle FS17. So but I got it when FS17 came out I bought it and I installed it and it was excellent and at first I got I thought it was very nice and looking very cool but there were no maps and there were no add-ons and uh, mods and that sort of stuff so I, I was sort of disappointed. This in-game stuff was cool but I wanted more. I had so much stuff for FS15 so I, I played FS15 a bit, f I mean some more actually and then I, and, um, for a while I played both just because I wanted to continue playing the maps I had 15. So that's what I did, and then uh, I switched basically. As stuff came out for fifth 17, I switched to 17 and played well. I played most 17, and then so now some good maps out. Counter line. This is a good map. There are plenty of good maps. Still not the amount the amount of maps we had for FS 15. And some of the maps I play there I really miss. I wish they would come for FF FS17, but some of those maps were uh, made by authors that probably won't put the time and effort into turning them into FS17. So they won't be adopted, adapted, uh, even though they were cool. I like those maps. There was one like not Finnish map. Nordic something I think Nordic map or uh, the name escapes me, but that was really cool and I really enjoy that. Um, we well I played that a lot. Uh, I wish that would come around to FS17, but I don't think it will. It didn't. It wasn't played a lot by people on 15, and I don't think the author would convert it. I haven't seen any conversion of it anyway, or any news on the own of it being converted, uh, which doesn't really matter to any, say anything. Author could do it when he or she wants to, but I haven't seen anything about it. Uh, then again, I haven't been looking too much at forums lately. Some people hang around in the forums a lot. I play the game a lot. How many pigs do we have? We had we had 140 picks. That's good. We'll will settle for that. So we're back to trail up here. And then I think oh that was bad. a tractor somewhere over here in the main yard I think uh, and then we're gonna call it quits for today I'm gonna fast forward till the morning a dog no that wasn't a dog it looked like a dog but it was not a dog So that's it. 
can close the yard here for the evening. Go over here. I thought about getting a class for uh, 780, I think it is, uh, as a har combine harvester, but uh, I haven't installed it, basically. Otherwise, that would be good. What was sort of recording? 25 minutes. And so, should I stop here or should I continue with this task? Hold on. Fast forward till the morning. This is good money. This is why I do this. To follow me a bit more. Whoa. Oh, this is not going very well, is it? And I'm sitting so close, I I keep hitting there. The, uh, what do you call that? Uh, the membrane you have in front of your microphone so it won't go when I talk. Um, like a chew train. Chew train. Stop. Like a train. Um, I keep hit hitting that. That's quite close to my head. That's why. I should probably make a movie of my setup someday and show you what I have or not have. Well, anyway, I'm gonna leave it there. I'll do this off screen, I think, or I'll do it on screen when you next time we meet. We'll see. Um, so this episode, we bought a new tr truck, a hook lift. We sold the other truck, um, our trailer, other our, our tanker, and we got a hook lift truck and uh, IT runner and some containers for fuel. Well, that's good. And um, what else? If you like this, this channel, please subscribe. If you like this episode, please hit the like button, leave a comment or share. Uh, any criticism is truly and greatly appreciated. Um, so I hope to see you soon and uh, I'll see you next time either on this back, the, Hofber the Hofbergman map or the other map I'm playing, which is the Palidorn map. So see you, take care, have a great day, bye bye.